Hey guys, WB Freedom Rant 21 back here with another video today, guys. And we were wondering, guys, why I'm not in the figurina. It's because starting now until like future figure man shows when I stop stop doing it. Is uh it's a new every like setup for a figure man 21 show. I'll still do normal videos on in the ring. So that's the light right there. Sorry, it doesn't have night like, normal light. But um we're gonna start doing figure man 21 shows now over here. So yeah, guys. So I hope you like enjoy this new little update. It's like this is like my table with the world title belt, the, the brawling buddy, and uh, uh, if you guys, uh, hold on, I'm about to show you guys. But these are all my WWE cups, some NXT title belts, and you know, I'm gonna explain why I have those on here. So guys, this is Figure Man 21 Show Episode 9, Season 3. Now next week, guys, I will be doing uh WWE Figure Man 21 Show next Saturday. Not Sunday, cause next Sunday will be part one of the fir of my first raw vlog. Cause next Sunday I'll be doing like a vlog of my first ever vlog, vlog of me like showing what I'm gonna be doing on raw. And then part two will be in two weeks from Monday. So today, guys, uh, we're gonna start off with Figure Man 21 show with uh, there's not gonna be a figure review, there's not gonna be a DVD review, but we are gonna be reviewing the newest WWE cups. From Carl's Jr. and Hardy's. Uh, these are the new cups that are Carl's Jr.'s. They have these little things you put in your straw in here. And you put like this on the inside. So each each cup, there's four cups. I have the full set. These are four cups you can collect. You can get the Shield, the Club with John Cena, the New Day, and some SmackDown and Raw women. And um, this one has Roman Reigns, Ambrose, and Rollins. Um, so that's and they have their names. Well, I don't understand if they have their names, but what's the point of them having their signatures when their names are right here? I mean, like, if you want to have this autograph, they just have to do it for you, which is kind of dumb. Uh, there's some copyright stuff, and then here's the because uh, these are based WrestleMania is promoting Carl's Jr., so that's why. And so, here's the WrestleMania 34 logo. Cool kids, and yeah, and then that's the bottom with some weird stuff. So yeah, that's uh, number one in that set. Number two is the club with Cena. Um, basically the same thing, but just with different coloring and si different superstars. The same thing, like I said, with Shield should have with just the na just stick with the name and just didn't have the autograph. But pretty cool uh, copyright, pretty cool images. Like I, the Balor is pretty cool from NXT. The copyright, the red, with the WrestleMania cool kids logo. Here is the green one, the third one from the set. Here's the New Day. Pretty cool one right here. WrestleMania logo and cool kids logo. And then we have the Raw and SmackDown women with Naomi, uh, Alexa Bliss, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I do recommend these cups. I can recommend these cups. Um, if you're like a hardcore wrestling collector and you're like want to collect uh, a bunch of wrestling cups for your collection, I would recommend these like in all in order. And uh, those are my other two cups with the Roman Reigns Bleacher Creature. And I plan on getting a seventh cup from uh, when I go to Raw because I hopefully it's not the same one as that one I had right there. But yeah, but these are the these are like coffee cups, miniature coffee cups. If you want to put in that in summary, but yeah, I would recommend these cups. These are pretty cool cups for collectible. But uh, yeah, I think they did a great job with these cups, and hopefully soon WWE can do more uh, kids meals with Carl's Juniors. I don't have the bag, sadly. Um, my dad brought the got them separately from like a, his the regular Carl's Junior uh, baggie, but not the WWE baggie baggie that they come with in. So, yeah, guys, that's uh, the Cups review, and let's get on to the next. I'm going to put them right here. So, guys, for Wrestling Talk of the Day, we're not going to do any, uh, we're not going to be using Stopping, but we can start using that soon. But today, guys, we're going to be talking about the newest NXT Championship, the North American Championship, that is supposed to be announced at ta NXT TakeOver New Orleans, in a ladder match with Ricochet, Killian Dane. EC3, Adam Cole, the Velveteen Dream, and, so, and some other guy. I just can't remember. I think it's only five people. They might add Tommaso Ciampa. 
uh, to the match. And he doesn't have a match, and plus Gargano has already left to NXT. No, uh, left NXT. So yeah. So my thoughts. I think it's a pretty good idea. I mean, I mean, I mean, it would make sense for them to have a mid card title, just like WWE has a mid card title. And NXT can have like their own because I know what WWE is planning on doing more belts because they're making 205 Live and NXT they're like their own brands because they have Drake, Drake Maverick as the and not like the general manager of NXT I mean not NXT of oh, 205 Live then you have William Regal as the manager of NXT so you want to expand that see if NXT can top the Raw and SmackDown rosters. And so like that, and make their own brand, make it better. I mean, let's be honest, SmackDown, Raw and SmackDown is just completely, Raw is okay. SmackDown is just boring at, at boring as always, and NXT is really entertaining. Maybe that's why they're doing this. Anyways, guys, I'm oh, sorry. Sorry about that, guys. I was, um, hold on, let me stop the video real quick, guys. Alright, sorry about that, guys. Alright, let's find something. But yeah, guys, so, um, that was my thoughts on the new NXT North American Championship belt. And let's get on to uh, sub, uh, shout out of the day. Today we're shout we're doing a shout out on Cesaro fan in 2011. A pretty cool YouTuber. He makes some pretty good videos, I guess. Especially like he's, he's a big fan of New Japan and WWE. Like here's one of his videos of his DVD collection. Like here's one. Yo, yeah, this is what I'm talking about. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys, that was, uh, subscriber of day of, uh, Cesaro Fan 2011. And I hope you guys enjoyed this little video, guys, of Figure 21 show up on 9, season 3. And episode 10 will be on next Saturday. But yeah, WWE Figure Man 21 out, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for my fast link review. Let's hope it's good, let's hope, let's, let's hope it's not bad. I'm hoping it's not. But anyways, guys, WWE Figure Man 21, here's the outro.